Hey, this is Dan Nickerson, and welcome to PluginBot.com. Uh, PluginBot is actually a WordPress plugin that will record all the plugins that you have on all of your WordPress blogs. So what you do is you install PluginBot, and it'll, it creates a record of all the plugins that you have on our master little PluginBot database. And then the next time you install PluginBot, it'll actually retrieve all those plugins that you previously installed and allow you to pick and choose which plugins you want on your latest blog and then use a one-click install to install them all. So as you can imagine, it'll save you a lot of time looking for plugins that you've previously installed. And I know that frustrates me, especially with the WordPress repository changing all the time. You might get confused by titles. You might spend a lot of time looking for a plugin that you installed on another blog. And so with PluginBot, you simply install it on your sites. It will retrieve all those plugins for you anytime, and you can quickly install them on your next blog. And I'm going to show you exactly how it works right now. Okay, so let me go to one of my uh, demo sites here. This is healthshakes101.com. You can see I have some plugins currently in the directory here. And I'm going to add plugin bot. So I'm going to click on Add New, Upload, Browse. I'm going to grab the zip file from my desktop right here. And I'm going to click on Install Now. And then I'm going to activate it. Okay, so I now have an activated plugin bot. And then I'm going to go to Settings, Plugin Bot. And you're going to see here there's a little message for new users. So if you're a new user, um, you need to create a plugin bot account. And what that does, it just creates an account on our server. It's a really simple name, username, password system. Uh, it takes you two seconds, and you create a plugin bot account. And then you're going to enter in your username and password on this side. So I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to I have an existing plugin bot account. And I'm going to log in. And I'll say, keep me logged in. And it should be logging in. Oop, didn't click it. Now it's logging in. So I've now I've logged in, and it's going to show me all the plugins that I currently have on this site right here. And it's going to show me all the plugins that I have on all the sites that I've previously installed plugin bot on. So you actually see that I've I've installed uh, this on six different test sites right here, and it shows how many times I have it installed. Uh, in future versions, we'll be able to tell you exactly what sites you have it all installed on. And that's kind of coming very soon. Um, now on the left hand side we have some plugins that aren't in the WordPress repository. Now, you know, PluginBot actually works better of course with free plugins, but if you have premium plugins and you actually know the download path to them, uh, then you can actually put the zip file path in here, check the box, uh, and add them. And what that will do is keep a record of where you can get those files. Uh, once again, premium plugins almost always have an authentication system as well, so you need to authenticate to get the plugin active. But like all these right here, I want to add those to my master plugin database. So boom, I just did that. It just refreshed it, and now all the plugins I have on this site are in my master plugin database of all the plugins I've ever installed. If I want to install a plugin to this site, I could A, I could just check all of these right now and I could click on install plugins and it would do that but I really don't want all of them so I'm gonna uncheck them all and let's just say that I want to add a couple of plugins here like maybe clean options and uh, this auto site map and maybe a cumulus tag cloud plugin I can just click on install plugins here and they'll install now if I want to automatically activate them I can check this box and then install now this is important, the update list here, what this does is it actually cleans up your WordPress plugin. So maybe there's a bunch of plugins that you no longer want on your list. Well if you check those plugins and then click on update list, it will remove them from our master plugin list. You can always get them back there, but it just sort of cleans the list. So this is for cleaning the list and this is for installing plugins. So I've checked a couple of plugins here, I'm just going to click on install plugins. It's now installing. As you can see, it just installed that one, it just installed that one, it just installed that one, and I'm done. So those plugins are now all installed on my site. It was very easy for me to find the plugins that I use on a regular basis, and that's what PluginBot does. Now, PluginBot, you know, is you shouldn't have paid anything for PluginBot. It's a free plugin, uh, but you may notice that we have a cool little feature over here called Add Premium. And I'm surprised that no one's ever done this before, but we literally just put a premium plugin uh, database in here. So if you're looking for premium plugins or a plugin that you don't find in the master WordPress repository database, you can probably find a premium plugin in our database. And that's how PluginBot works right there. And this all comes from our PluginBot review blog. So you can click on this and load up the review on PluginBot. You'll see right there. And that's how cool this little system is. So I encourage you to download PluginBot today, create an account. Actually, if you're on the site, you can click on download. And uh, you just need to join. There's a little join here. 
enter your first name and email, confirm, and then you get a registration link and the download and you'll be good to go. So that's it with PluginBot and I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks.